guys welcome back to my channel i have a wig to show you guys today and i'm really really excited about this particular unit because i have never ever used anything like this before or had anything like this before so this unit is from her given hair it was delivered in the brown box you guys saw comes in a very luxurious lush looking black box i love the fact that it just looks expensive looks luxurious when you open that black box up you're going to see that there is tissue paper you just open that up it's very delicate so you open it and the wig itself is sealed in a plastic bag it's a very good way to make sure that the wig travels very very well take the tissue bag out and inside the box you get a manual and some just flyers inside and there's also a satin pouch for you to store your wig in it has her giving her written on it one thing i like i love 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 about this pouch is the fact that it has a drawstring okay you guys will see that shortly so a nice drawstring makes it very very easy to just store and just package this wig especially if you want to travel okay take the wig out and you'll see that there's a little paper inside that has wig specifications these wig specifications will pop up on the screen there's this nice net covering it just to make sure that the curls are intact taking all of that off but just in case you're wondering this wig is 16 inches 185 grams and the color is natural texture you get with this is like 3c to 4a the wig cap is so neat like the tracks are so neat and the curls you guys can see like i said 3c to 4a and this is just what it looks like straight out of the box okay i have not done anything to this hair at this point so this is the curl texture you get with it the most exciting thing about this wig however is this kinky baby hairs that it comes with okay this is basically the way your own hair looks okay in its natural state okay these baby hairs mimic our own hair texture it's also the wig itself in a very very short length i just love it inside this wig you also get combs and two in the front and one at the back i think to help you secure it properly there is an elastic band also to help it sit properly and this elastic band is adjustable so you can unhook and hook it it has about three layers or levels or it's like oh, i don't know how to say it, but it has about six hooks in total and then this is what the wig looks like straight out of the box this is the curls you get so what i'm going to do at this stage is take this wig off and go and co-wash it i'm going to be using this as i am conditioner to co-wash in the bathroom so i'm going to apply this conditioner like heavily i am not mising this and i just want to make sure that i saturate the hair completely with conditioner this is going to make co-washing easy it's going to make the hair so soft it's also just going to just get into the curls loosen them up define them and make them so so soft so co-washing is easy it's just basically washing your hair but with conditioner and not shampoo it makes your hair very very soft even your own natural hair and makes this well, psh, curly wigs and this wig especially very very soft it will make it so soft so I'm just rinsing out all that conditioner the wig is so soft and bouncy at this point i'm going to go in with a leave-in conditioner at this point this one that i'm using is by mega growth and it's water based and this is just going to help me define the curls and just make everything or just also i'm also shaping the hair okay at this stage as well while i work in the conditioner i'm just running my fingers through it the hair is soft it's also damp at this point so it's making manipulation very easy for me okay and once i am done with this i'm just going to set this wig here just leave it here to dry overnight i'm not going to touch it after this but i'll just leave it to dry overnight okay it's so soft guys this hair is so so soft and bouncy at this stage so soft so after i've shaped i'm just going to trim off any like loose ends or any hair that is sticking out to make sure that it just holds a particular shape spray some water again and just trim and this is the next day the wig has dried overnight so at this point i'm just putting it on my head to see how it sits okay it sits well i'm also pulling it 
forward to see what the baby hairs look like so i'm going to wear this wig in two different ways the first way is with the baby hair slicked down with edge control and then the second way is without any product on the edges whatsoever but first i'm going to wear it with the edges slicked down with edge control so i'm just cutting or trimming off the lace at this point i like to just see where it sits before i start trimming the lace so i've gotten the lace off and i'm putting the hair back on my head just to see it sitting well at this point okay so this kinky edges is just like one of a kind you guys can see that they just it looks like your own hair but short okay i have some edge control on my own natural hair at this point too okay because my hair was relaxed with this first install so you guys could see how it looked without my own hair showing through i applied some powder to make the lace blend more with my skin tone and once i've just put the wig on my head at this stage i'm going to clip it up and then i'll go in with edge control the edge control that i'll be using is from or by smith hair and this is a very very good edge control and it's perfect for natural hair so i'm going to go on ahead and just sleek the edges down with a brush So after that I'm going to tie those edges down and just kind of tie it down for about 20 minutes and just at this stage I'm going to try to fluff the hair out with some water again just to add some softness again to it. So I've gone in with the hot comb just to kind of define the part and then after that this is what the hair looks like okay this is what it looks like after I've kind of manipulated it and used my hair you guys can see that the edges look very very natural it looks like what your own natural edges look like with edge control okay I wanted to show you guys this because I know that some of you would love to wear this wig like this okay so this is like some weeks later and at this point i have some new growth at the front of my hair and i really want to show you guys how i blend this wig with my own natural edges i'm going to go in with a gel and this particular glue or gel is not like permanent glue or gel like this is the kind you can wash off okay and i've just kind of applied this just around my ears that's the only i didn't apply it on any other part of my hairline just the size of my ears to hold the wig down in those two areas tie down as usual for about 20 minutes taking the band off okay and at this point it's just kind of melted and it's set in place okay so you guys can see what the edges look like i'm just going to go in with a brush just to comb it brush it. you guys can see that you can't even tell that i'm wearing a wig at this point it's blended so well with my own hairline that you cannot tell where the wig starts and where my own edges end or start okay it looks like this wig is growing straight out of my scalp i love it so much I'm going to leave additional information for this unit in the description box in case you are interested. Give this video a thumbs up if you liked it. I love you guys and I will see you in my next one.